today I'm going to do a re quick review of my gaming headset, the headset that I use when I when I video, when I game on my PC. Yeah, out. And also when I use uh, it to create my videos for YouTube. Uh, first off, uh, really quickly, it's this is a, it's kind of a comparison what? because I just got a new headset. So um, this uh, is the gaming set or the headset that I've been using, which is a Tiamat Razer. You won't be receiving any razors from us to demolish your manhood. 7.1 surround sound. Uh, it's a really, really nice headset. In each ear, it has five different drivers five different little speakers. Uh, it's a closed back design as you can see. The microphone is right here. Comes out. Uh, not a very, very good microphone. In fact, I have on my, uh, on my normal PC over there, uh, you can see I've got a Rode microphone. Um, so I don't use this and I, ha I haven't used it from the very get-go. It's a, a cool little deal. It has this little amp that allows you to switch this knob allows you to switch the volumes for the subwoofer for the front speakers the back speakers the regular speakers and the microphone it's kind of cool it, it spins you can turn it on and off by pushing this button uh, you can also mute it here uh, you can mute the mic here that one of these buttons one of these buttons mutes it one of the buttons just turns the whole thing off and one of the buttons turns it from stereo to the seven speaker surround sound or the seven way surround sound it's not seven speakers uh, really really nice headset for what it's designed for like I said it's a closed back design so it that allows for a little better bass and um, the the one thing it restricts is the sound stage and we'll get to that in a second it is on the ear padding and you can see that I've worn it out um, because I, I wear it a lot it's on the ear padding the pads the pads are pretty comfortable this does end up hurting my my head after a while uh, maybe I don't know if anybody else has had that same problem but it you know and sometimes I can game for a couple hours and really piss off my wife which she doesn't like. So there's a couple things that, that I do to piss off my wife. I ride my R1 and I game. Um, wh the one thing I really disliked about this thing from the get-go is this, this head support system is just a horrible design. It's like a floating design and it's, and it's, and I don't know if you can see that or not, but it's on elastic and uh, it's just a horrible design. Had I known about that from the get-go, I wouldn't have. I wouldn't have bought the headset. I would have looked for something else. Uh, I just don't like it. Doesn't feel like it's on your head very well. That's just my my um, experiences, uh, at least for what I'm doing. I'm just a basic old consumer. These are the these are the plugins for the the headset. This is for the power for the little amp thing. And then you have the difference for subwoofer, uh, your normal speakers, your front speakers, your back speakers, and then your microphone. Pretty cool setup. The boxing is ridiculous. Look at that dragon. Whew, Bruce Lee would be, a, be impressed with that dragon. You have offended my family and you have offended the Shaolin Temple. So anyway, um, good, good headset all around. I haven't had, well, I've, the, my only two complaints was the microphone's not very good and this thing is just horrible. Now, I ended up getting a better headphone set and this is an actual music headphones. These are the Sennheiser, which is known for making great products. And this is the HD 598 SE Special Edition. The only difference between this and the regular 598 is the color. I really, really like the color. And then they come with a different, um, they actually come with a, a shorter cord that most people would use for their um, their phones. I put I, I use these on my phones and they sound tremendous. Now, here what's the difference? What's the difference between the two? One, this these things sound so much better 
It's unbelievable how much better these things sound than those razors. It's, I, I can't even tell you how much. I, the, on the first day that I got these, I, I listened to my uh, um, S7, my, my Samsung S7, and I got about 600 songs on them. And I have I heard things with this headset that I'd never heard in in those songs before. Oh my goodness! Just so clear, very balanced tone to them. Very very nice headset, right? Um, it's an open back design. So the difference between these two is the open back design allows for a better sound stage. So it, it, it allows you to hear music as it was supposed to be, as if you were on a, 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 in the middle of a stage and you can hear different instruments from different locations. Now, how does that equate into gaming? It's just phenomenal. It is, as far as directional sound goes, and if you're looking for a great gaming headset, and you, you're, you're willing to deal with not having a mic because these don't have a mic, then I would recommend these if you game in a quiet room because the open back design allows for noise to get into the headset, but it also creates, um, and I don't know how they do it, uh, but it creates space in your sound. So you can hear footsteps that are 20 feet away coming up from your back left side. You can hear the airplane flying over your front right side. And you, you know, it's, it's, I don't know how they do it, but it's freaking amazing. I thought surround sound was good on this until I heard it on the Sennheisers. Um, I, I couldn't be happier with this headset. It is the, it's, you know, now, now granted, I've only, I'm only comparing them to this headset and then all the earbuds that I've had. Um, and there's no comparison how this music sounds. Now, I used to be a bass head when I grew up. Um, I, I, when, I, when I was in high school, my car had uh, 215s and 412 subwoofers in it, you know, and so, so you know, my friends and, and my mom can hear me when I'm coming home half a block down the road. I think I just came in my panties. Uh, so I understand bass. Uh, I love bass. And one of the complaints about these, this headset is, well, you don't, you don't get bass like it, or uh, you don't get bass like if you were listening to beats. Well, that's not necessarily true. Uh, it is a cleaner bass that uh, just sounds marvelous. I would much prefer listening to the sound of music, uh, especially music with good lows um, in this headset than in this headset, which has a lot of good bass, certainly more bass than, th than this headset, but the bass in that headset, in the uh, Razer, is just not as clean as uh, in the Sennheiser. Now granted, I don't know all the technical terms for how sound should, um, how you should state sounds, sounds, <laughs> uh, but I do know that these Sennheisers are one, built very well, and two, uh, I don't, I, I feel like these things could last an extremely long time. Um, they're certainly more comfortable with the earphone pads um, than uh, these and they plug into my phone quite i bought this aftermarket uh, cord which is really really nice they have this they have this little adapter and i don't know if you can see it or not uh, but it, it but it slides in it's unique to the sennheisers um, so you have to buy a cord that's specific for uh, the sennheiser uh, brand uh, but it plugs in and this thing stays in and then this fitting per fits perfectly on my phone with my uh, phone protector on. So it comes with this cord, 
this long this oh, it's probably a three and a half foot cord and then also comes with a longer cord probably about a nine foot cord which I have already on my computer you can't necessarily see it but I have it already on my computer uh, so that's nice it comes with two cords it allows you to do multiple things with the headset so uh, I don't know if that's gonna help you or not uh, as far as a gaming's headset goes I paid two hundred dollars for this a couple years ago and I paid 140 bucks for this uh, a couple weeks ago and my $140 was so much better well spent than my $200 on, on this Razer headset. So uh, if you're in the market for a good gaming headset that makes music sound as spectacular as it can sound, I would recommend at least going to a place where you can listen to these Sennheisers. Uh, the um, five nine eights um, are renowned for being a great quality uh, headset. Um, so I hope this helped you out. Have a great, awesome day.